dealing with unforgiveness? 25 years. Great, Scott. 25 years. Wow. At this time, Monday through Friday, it's called the Encouraging Story of the Day. And if you want to get involved, you just call us 800 900 1300. What was the moment? How did you find the, the grace and the ability to forgive? I've been doing a Bible study on idolatry, and I realized my idol was anger and frustration. And I was able to pray and ask the Lord to be able to forgive her. And he prompted me to pick up my phone and to call her and tell her I forgive her and that I love her. So do you want to talk about what happened? What caused the, the issue between you and her? Yeah, well... We had a rough childhood. It was always not good. She was never there, always working, and um, left us in the wrong caregiver's hands. Oh, gotcha. So some bad things happened because of that. Yep, and I just always never forgave her. I always blamed her. Yeah. But through the grace of God, I was able to say, I forgive you. And a huge weight lifted off my shoulders. Absolutely. What was your mother's response? She started crying, and she said, I've been waiting for this day. She always kind of blamed herself, but I didn't I didn't want to let it go. I held such a tight grudge. But she knew it was wrong, too, but that didn't matter to you. It still, she still did this, and it was still upsetting to you to hold on mm -hmm. to. Yeah, gotcha. Wow. Only the power of God, I mean, especially if you seems like you're justified in how you feel, that can really hurt. Yeah. I can't even tell you the amazingness I feel now. Wow. That's so awesome. And Kate, you bring up an interesting point. I think something that might help us to forgive is knowing that we all want justice. Exactly. Served. Yeah. And the truth is, justice will be served. And in the meantime, what I love about that is we don't have to lust after vindication. We can, by God's grace, forgive, knowing that God will take care of the rest. It's amazing. I guess that's part of the weight lifted is realizing, oh, I don't have to punish the person who did me wrong. No, and now I can start to rebuild a relationship with her. My hope is one day to bring her to Christ. Oh, that would be neat. Rebecca, so happy for you. Yeah, and we pray that your mom will come to know him. Well, thank you so much. Kayla.